Yeah. Hey, good morning. Oh, good morning. We're uh, oh, we're, 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 we're having a, a discussion about the power of the Holy Spirit in our lives. Oh, here we are. Yeah. yeah, here we are talking about it. And so, Greg was talking how you wonder if we can call on the Spirit to be in our lives. Greg was given a couple of examples. Um, one by Jesus. Yeah. Go ahead and that, that example again about this. That Jesus told the disciples, his apostles, to go out to evangelize. Like to go out into the world and to spread his word in, in the world. And he told them, when you go out, where you, you have the sandals on your feet and the cloak on your back. And that's just about it. You don't carry a purse. You don't worry about food. You don't worry about money. You know, whatever. Because even the birds of the air have a place that the, the, the the Almighty God gives them a place to stay, and then He'll do the same for the apostles. So the apostles are going out preaching or evangelizing, spreading Jesus' word. They're not to take all kinds of stuff with them. But He said, you need to go to a town. When you go to a town, you go to you stay in one house, and you invite the Spirit to reside at that house while you're there. And so that's what I'm wondering. Do we ever bring the Spirit with us, or do we ask the Spirit to come upon the place when we, when we travel and go somewhere? Do we leave the Spirit there with them? You know, for me, and you might call me overconfident, but I believe I walk with the Spirit. I call on the Spirit. The Spirit comes with me. I can believe in my heart that I can call the Spirit at will. Because we have to realize that we have the powers of Christ by being part of his body, by being sharing in his kingship and his priestlyhood. Jesus Christ gives us the ability and the power to spread the word. So yes, call in the spirit to enter the home that you enter and you be the conduit of Christ to them people. Any last words? Don't be afraid. God bless you.